that's what it looks like. If you want to take a look, that's the inside, never use. And I'm going to go for it. We're going to, we're trying this out. I mean, what do I have to freaking lose besides my hair? What's going on, you guys? It's George. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another Tommy Hilfiger video. Today, we are trying out something known as Tommy's Slick Trick. I'm going to give you a moment to let that sink in. Yeah, Tommy's Slick Trick. You guys, I've been searching the internet practically on Tommy Hilfiger Deep Web right now, finding very unique and rare Tommy pieces. Tommy's Slick Trick is a hair clay. It's a pomade, it's a hair product, it's something that's gonna give your hair texture, volume, and just, you know, make it stay in place and do its thing, I suppose. I suppose, because I read reviews about this, guys. I have no idea when this beauty product by Tommy Hilfiger was created, but I found it on eBay. I also found a few on other websites as well. Luckily, I was able to come across a brand new bottle of Tommy Slick Trick. Never used, never opened, and I have it right here in this package. So today, I'm gonna get ready. We're gonna do a little get ready with me, Tommy Hilfiger style and I'm gonna try this out. I don't know if this is expired. I don't know anything about this, to be honest. I have not seen online like when this was created or when Tommy Hilfiger actually had beauty products. But Tommy, if you're watching this, it is a brilliant idea to dip into the beauty community right now. It is booming. Everybody is creating beauty products. Rihanna is creating beauty products. Uh, Kesha, you name it. I mean, everybody and their mom practically has beauty products. So you're already a brand that's prestigious AF, and I think you would kill it in the beauty community. I would be honored to be a face of the brand. I volunteer as tribute. For love, Tommy Hilfiger, we're gonna give this a go. Hopefully my hair doesn't fall out. Hopefully I'm not bald at the end of this video, but um, we will see. If you're interested in this Tommy experience, then keep on watching. Tommy Slick Trick, you guys, what a name. That is iconic to begin with. Aside from Tommy like having a beauty product, that name in general, just like, I live for it. It's amazing. I just wanna let you guys know, I'm gonna fill you in a little bit. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe, hit the notification bell, I would love your company. I talk about all things Tommy Hilfiger on here. I have a playlist of all my videos. I have content that's probably like two hours long worth of me going to thrift stores looking for vintage pieces, the Tommy outlet, department stores looking for Tommy pieces, you name it. This is honestly your number one source for everything Tommy Hilfiger related. So join the family. I'm not new when it comes to beauty products. I'm actually, <laughs> an influencer. I kind of don't like the word influencer, so I like to say content creator, but I try tons of men's beauty products and just any beauty products, to be honest with you. I, I'm, I'm not judgmental when it comes to beauty, skincare, or anything like that. If it's going to spruce me up a bit, make me look good, perhaps give me like health benefits, I'm going to try it out. So I actually do have four hair clays right here. I just want to let you know, this is just how much I am experienced in the hair clay department. So I'm just not, you know, Anybody, I have, I have experience, you know what I mean? Little example right there. So I, uh, I'm gonna be honest and brutal with my judgment of this clay. So I have nothing in me pelo right now. Pelo? Pelo, that's hair in Spanish, right? Pretty sure. <laughs> my hair, nothing in my hair. Um, as you can see, it's flat, it's boring, and it looks like a child's hair. <laughs> I know, I know. This is a new style I'm trying to work with, so bear with me. That's the bag and very protected for a hair clay. I'm loving it. I'm super excited just to have this within my Tom Hilfiger collection, number one, but also the simple fact that this is a like beauty product of Tommy and it's extremely rare and never used. I mean, the first one to use it, I'm, I, I love it. I love that idea. Oh, I'm gonna get it out of here though. Oh my God, you can already see the Tommy Hilfiger logo peeking out of the package. There we go. Oh my, Tommy's Slick Trick. I'm living that freaking name. That name is amazing. So we have Tommy Hilfiger, the logo, hair pomade. Uh, looks like this is a 2.5 ounce jar. I'm a huge appreciator of luxury beauty and this, it has weight to it. It doesn't feel cheap, doesn't look cheap and it definitely, it's an elevated product. This is not a got to be hair clay. This is not a Garnier Fructis. This is not a, a rave. I don't know. I'm not, I'm foreign when it comes to cheap self-care products, guys. I feel like your body is an investment and you really should not be uh, cheap in that department. Amen. Give me a thumbs up if you agree. 
<laughs> no, seriously though, I feel like you really gotta take care of yourself and watch the ingredients and what you're putting onto your skin, your hair, your body, inside and out. There's actually a description on the jar describing the product, so we, we have to read that. It says, Tommy Slick Trick, high gloss emollient, not familiar with that word, um, emollient. Formula gives hair extraordinary shine, helps style, condition, and create definition, control flyaway hair. Right for sleek, wet, straight hair looks. My hair is straight the house, so hopefully this gives me some type of volume. Uh, to use, work through damp or dry hair, style as usual. And this is Tommy Hilfiger, New York, New York, uh, London, Paris, Milan. Made in the USA, I love that. We love this is made in the USA, gotta preach. Um, barcodes on here. I'm looking for an expiration date just to be on the safe side. Tommy Hilfiger and our registered trademarks. So this is most definitely a Tommy Hilfiger piece. That's one thing I was kind of like a little skeptical about. I was like, Tommy made beauty products, what? I was shook. So um, no expiration date, you guys. I am reading the ingredients. They don't seem too crazy. So we're gonna try it. We're gonna try, of course we're gonna try it. For love of Tommy, we're gonna try it. Let's open it up. <laughs> Let's open it up, guys. The top is a screw off lid. There it is, brand new, brand spanking new Tommy Hilfiger, Tommy Slick Trick. I'm shook at freaking name. Ooh, that does not smell the best. Um, I'm not gonna lie, it smells a little weird. It does smell, I mean, I, I smell expired products before this does smell a little expired. Uh, I'm not sure if that's something that was scent related or if it's like an ingredient that is important for this but um that's what it looks like if you want to take a look that's the inside never use and i'm gonna go for it we're gonna we're trying this out i mean what do i have to freaking lose besides my hair oh okay so it's definitely oily like i put my finger right in it and the consistency is buttery see that it's kind of like reminds me of uh, coconut oil in a way um, I'm gonna look greasy. I'm, I know if I, there's anything this is probably gonna provide me, it's probably like a greasy look. I could wash my hair, okay? All right, so it just melted right into my hands and I'm just going to style my hair. That was a decent amount too, guys. I, I was not, you know, stingy with the amount that I put in my hair. So I already see the shine. This is, <laughs> this is definitely providing a shine and a glossy look that's that is certain um let's put a little bit on the side so i air dried my hair the way that it already was that's the way that my hair i like to have it laid when i you know style it but i mean it's giving me just high gloss i'm not really experiencing anything as far as you know it keeping my hair in place so it's not a structure style of clay but it's definitely uh, nourishing, oily. Um, I wonder how this is gonna make me look later on the day. If you're interested about that, stay tuned on my Instagram. Follow the House of Hilfiger. That's my Tommy Hilfiger appreciation page. I post tons of stuff on there. Tommy related. It's all Tommy related, actually. And um, I will be letting you guys know on there how this is holding up. So let me just spray my favorite hairspray. This is the Sexy Hair Big. Spray and stay by uh, yeah, big sexy. So I gotta give myself a little bit of a freeze because I feel like this is gonna make me oily and make my hair just, you know, like that. Hopefully it's registering the same on video as it is like in this mirror right here because honestly guys, it looks a little damp, but it doesn't look bad. It does not look bad. I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of, I'm kind of digging this. The smell though, that's, um, is not my favorite. So I'm gonna rinse my hands off real quick. Before I go, I have one more thing I wanna share with you guys. And I have a vintage pair of Tommy Hilfiger sunglasses in this box. Yes, you guys, I won another auction and I've been looking for early 2000s Tommy Hilfiger stuff left and right. And let me tell you, I've been finding some treasures. This is a, well, I've never seen this in person yet, but they were beautiful online. Uh, early 2000s sunglasses are very unique. They're either oversized or they're just normal size, but tinted colored. I'm 
loving that. I'm loving everything like 2000s right now and I'm super freaking excited. I'm hoping these fit. All right, so there we go. Nothing else in the Z box. And I'm not sure what color this is because on eBay, they were like a yellowy color. And right now they're kind of looking like a beige, which I'm not mad because I feel like that's gonna go with a lot more. You guys, these are beautiful. Oh my God. So I didn't make sure I disclosed, these are listed as women's glasses, but anyone could wear them. I hate how there's like gender on like fashion. It's kind of crazy. The color is kind of like orangey in a way, but it's also brown. It's like a really neat color. I feel it's gonna go with a lot of my pieces, but the TH is right there in the corner and it's a really unique TH. It's kind of like, the T is going into the H, loving that. And there's a model number on the side, it says TH8023BRN. So I'm assuming that's brown, um, abbreviation of brown. And does it tell me he'll figure on this side? Guys, these are freaking awesome. The nose pieces are a little, well, not little, <laughs> they're, they're dingy to house, but I'm not mad. I mean, nobody ever sees those pieces anyways. So let me try them on, let's see how this looks. Stop. Oh my God. No way. These are beautiful. These are, these are sick. <laughs> I'm obsessed. Okay. So I actually paid um, a lot of money for these, but they're vintage. And also they are unique AF. These are not your typical Ray-Bans. These are not your, your basic B sunglasses. These are sunnies that are going to make a statement. They're going to make you look lit this summer and they're brown, so perhaps the fall as well, but I'm gonna rock these left and right. I'm so excited with this purchase. These are insane. I am very happy with my two Tommy Hilfiger purchases. Tommy Hilfiger vintage purchases. I'm still waiting for the Tommy drops on the website. They're supposed to be like one of a pastel drop, which is not hit yet for us US customers. And there's also like an artist collaboration that was done and neither of them are available for us here in the United States of America. So I don't know what's going on with that, but I'm sitting here like quaking in my seat because I, I, I also do have some very exciting Tommy Hilfiger news that I'll be sharing with you guys very shortly. No, I'm not in a campaign yet. No, they have never reposted any of my photos on their Instagram page yet, but something else really good did happen. So <laughs> stay tuned for that, which means you have to subscribe to my channel, click the notification bell. That is super important because if you don't click the bell, Mel, <laughs> the bell is super important, just like Taco Bell. So please click the bell. I'd appreciate it. It means you're going to be notified when I upload a new video. If you want to show me some love, give this video a thumbs up. I would highly appreciate that. Sound off in the comment section. I would love to chat with you as well. Do not forget to join this Tommy Hilfiger family and the Tommy Hilfiger community. Until next time, and as always, say thanks, give compliments, and think positive. And I'll catch you in the next video. Bye, guys.